the trending report here with Dr. Jack Dibis at Revive Hydration Clinic, the first of its kind in Chicago. Tell me a little bit about your concept and what services you provide here. Uh, we here at Revive our hydration clinic, as you said, and what we do is people can come in and get rehydrated, basically. Uh, there are many causes of dehydration. Living in Chicago, the climate is very harsh, uh, especially this time of the year. Um, so we treat all forms of dehydration. Our five main um, target groups are people who have colds and flus that are dehydrated. We have athletes that come in and get the vitamin B and the rehydration. People who are hungover is another case. And then also uh, people with jet lag or general malaise or chronic fatigue or, or something like that. Also, with women seem to like it, the health and beauty aspects. You get rehydrated from within instead of from the topical standpoint. You've been open for a month and word has already been spreading like wildfire. Local papers have dubbed you the hangover doctor. You've been listed as a place to go after New Year's Eve. Is this, you've just listed five things at a minimum that you do here. Is that the image that you want to portray? Um, like I said, we're a hydration clinic and I don't want to be associated solely with hangovers. It is one of the things and I think because of the time of year when we're opening, there are a lot of parties for the holidays, New Year's is right around the corner. I think that the natural association for most of the media is to put two and two together and say, hydration, hangovers. That's not the focus of our clinic at all. Um, in fact, yesterday we had 13 patients and eight of them were here for cold and flus. And I think that as the year progresses, our clientele will change. Right now, there is a decent amount of people who are coming in for hangovers. And like I said, though, even with that, the majority are cold and flu right now. And I think once we get into January and February in Chicago, you'll see more of that. Once we get in the summer months, you'll see more people coming in for the athletic benefits. Throughout the year, you'll see people coming in for the, the general malaise, jet lag kind of chronic fatigue, and also the health and beauty aspects of it. Tell me a little bit about the process. If I'm a client and I come in, I walk through those doors, and what happens next? Um, when you come in, you'll be greeted by a receptionist where they will take your information down. It's just like as if you were to go to an emergency room. There's a, a health form you fill out, uh, the history, what you're feeling, uh, sign a consent, sign all the waivers. They take your blood pressure there, then they'll bring you back to my office here where there'll be a nurse who will start the IV. I will question you as far as why you're here, things like that, go over a good history to get an idea of what, what is ailing you really. And then from there, I'll decide which treatment is gonna be best suited for you whether it's going to be for the hangover, whether it's for cold and flu, whether it's the jet lag. So there are different additives that we add depending on what your symptoms are. Once the IV started, you'll be taken out to uh, the seating area of your choice. We have a lounge area with a TV. We have quiet rooms where it's more isolated and, and quiet. Uh, we're also going to end up having a VIP room, and then we're going to have a second lounge room. Um, and at that point, the, another nurse out on the floor will administer the medicines that I've ordered and then she'll check and see how you're doing throughout your stay. And also, if we need to add more fluids or, or add more medicines, we'll assess you as, as you're there, just like we would in the ER. How long is the process, and what is the price? It takes approximately 45 minutes, depending on how much fluid you get. Uh, there is one additive we use, a multivitamin, uh, that is going to be coming out, and that takes up to two hours just because of the manufacturer recommendations at the speed at which you have to administer it. It takes two hours uh, to do that. Uh, the price is $99 with the exception of adding $25 for that multivitamin. So whatever it takes. If it takes two liters, if it takes three liters, if it takes a couple extra shots of the medicine, I don't want to feel like people are getting nickel and dimed and upcharged. I want to make this as pleasant an experience because if you're sick, you're not feeling well, nobody likes that. And I want you to come in and then leave happy and be able to have a productive day. And how often should people come in for treatment? Is it possible to come too much? Uh, it is, especially if you're drinking. And we don't condone overindulgence of that type. It happens this time of the year especially. And if it does happen, then we're here to alleviate your symptoms. Well, when you do talk about your customers and you look at how the layout of your establishment is, you have Wi-Fi, you have the television, you have Canada kind of Lounge, so you can cater to the various clients that you have. Yes, um, we wanted to make it, and it was since it's a newer concept, we wanted to keep the integrity of a hospital setting, but we didn't want it to be that austere hospital, clean, sterile. We also wanted to bring some of the 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 spa-like characteristics, so they're comfortable. There are people who don't like to go to hospitals, they don't want to have anything to do with a hospital. But at the same 
time you don't want to make it too spa like and too relaxing I, I, you know I want to stress that we always have a board certified physician on staff who's here at all times we always have our nurses our fully registered licensed nurses. This is the first of its kind in Chicago, but this is a concept that you and your buddies would talk about in college. Yeah, about 20 years ago when I was at the University of Dayton, my friends and I would be sitting around on maybe a Sunday afternoon and kind of lamenting our activities of the last two days and say it'd be nice if we could get a transfusion or some kind of IV solution to kind of cleanse us. Um, and then as I went through my medical training, if we were sick, uh, you had to still work. So you would get IV fluids, you would get some Zofran, which is anti-nausea medicine, and you'd be back at work. And it's, like I said, this is a well-known treatment. I, you know, just for somebody to say they made it up is a fallacy. This is one of those things that's out in the ether that everybody knows about. Everybody in medicine has been doing this for years, especially, like I said, the EMTs, paramedics, anybody in emergency setting, military personnel have all done it when battlefield conditions. Uh, there are a lot of people who know about this and have been doing it for years. We're just trying to bring it to the general public. Is there anything else that you would like to say that I did not ask you about? I'd just like to stress the uh, overall concept of the clinic is, is wellness, really. We want to give people back time that they would have lost otherwise due to illness or whatever reason they're not feeling well. Uh, we like that people can come in, and if it was going to be a day where you were already calling in sick and, not, and kind of chalking it up as a loss, so you can come and feel better and go out and go shopping or go to the gym or finish that work project that you're doing. Uh, and it's all about trying to make people's life just a little bit better. I think nowadays, more so than in the past, things happen at such a, a fast pace um, that it's easier, while you can get a lot done in a short amount of time, it's easy to get way behind in whatever you're doing in a short amount of time. So if you lose a day or two, uh, you can really get behind in everything. And then that affects your life going down for the next you know, three, four, five days after that because you're now you're trying to play, play catch up. Um, so. What we're doing is really giving the gift of time and trying to help people out um, just basically to live a better life and a more productive life and a happier life. Thank you so much, Dr. Dipers, for sitting down with the Trending Report here at Revive Hydration Clinic.